Hey y'all, so I'm in a mood to like DIY, okay? I do my own acrylics, my own waxes, I can lay my own wigs, and I'm not really a lash girly, but I kind of want to try to be one. I'm really nervous to get eyelash extensions because you always hear about somebody's eyelashes falling out, you always hear about people saying they have uh, eye things going on, like infections and things. I always hear about people saying they hate the way they look when they don't have them and I don't want to feel that way about myself but I feel like my confidence is somewhat where it needs to be in order for me not to feel that way and I'm kind of excited to get into the lash part of things. One of my co-workers suggested that I try these Kiss Impress lashes. It's no glue needed. They are little clusters, short, medium, and long. And I got the wispy set because I didn't want anything to be super dramatic, super curled, super crazy long. Um, but if that doesn't work or they don't last as long as I need them to, which I still might end up using this, but I got the Bond and Seal from the like Falscara kit. Um, with this, I've heard a lot of great things, and also if I want them to last longer, which I do, especially for my first time, so, yeah, we're just gonna get into it. Like I said, this one has short, medium, and long lashes, so we're just gonna come up with a style and see where it goes. I started by getting the makeup off of my eyelashes, like all my mascara and everything, and just patted you know my eyes dry so they're nice and clean and i guess ready for application being that i do want to use the bond i'm going to um just read the instructions it says step one use a light coat of the bond apply the wispy lash with the applicator and seal the deal so it's a three-step process um i'm excited let's do it in every video that I've seen with the Falscara lashes, they say only use the bond at the base of your lash. So I'm just going to do exactly that. And I'm also going to do it in sections from outer corner to inner corner. Yeah, just see how it goes. I'm going for the cat eye effect. So I'm going to be using the longer lashes at the end and then in my inner corner, the shorter ones. Okay, so I have one lash cluster on right now and it's kind of long. I don't know how I like it just yet, but I think I might go two or three mediums and then two or three smalls just to kind of build up the thickness of it. But um, as of right now, it seems to be pretty easy, but I don't want to speak too soon because you know how shit can go left in heartbeat. So once I'm done with all that, I'm just going to seal it all at the same time. Okay, so these are on. I had a couple here but it was just too much for me um i don't know how i feel about it yet and i'm not sure if i want to seal it because i don't know if i want to keep them on so i'm gonna think about it and then i'll come back okay i think i got the lashes the way i want them to look now i'm just gonna take the seal end of the falscara and basically just go on the root of each little section that I did and I might also do some on the top. Okay y'all so the lashes are done. I'm gonna take my hair out and make sure that I like the way it looks with my hair down but um as of right now I feel like it was pretty easy. Uh we're just gonna see how long it lasts but let me quickly take my hair out, brush it out, and I'll be back. Okay y'all so this is how the lashes look. I'm super excited because I like the way they look right now. I'll be sure to let you guys know how they wear, how long they last, and if my eyes get irritated or anything like that. Once again I did want to mention these are the Kiss Impress Press On Falsies that I used and then the Falscara Bond and Seal. So I'm really excited. I really like the way they look and I'm excited for this new like lash journey so stay tuned if you guys want to hear about how they wore and how they make me feel so yeah thank you guys for watching thank you guys for being here see you guys next time bye y'all